the seas today. But you gotta make do with what days you're given. Yeah, heading out overnight adventure, just leaving the cinder here. Um, Stabycraft camps, 12.0. I'm going to try to do a bit of filming. I get pretty lazy with it, but I'm going to try and pump down the video. Get some footage. I've got all the fly rods, all the camp gear. Everything you need to stay out at night. The rain, you can see it. It's raining out this way, so hopefully we can get out the reef. Smack a GT or something. I'm going to try and get one on the fly this time. And tuck in the Palm Island group somewhere. For a camp on the boat. Should be good. Anyway, I'm just gonna get over this bar. The old famous Lucinda bar. Punch back this way and then head out. It's pretty nice though, isn't it? Alright. Got to see you out the reef. Doesn't look too bad, but who knows? Let's give it a go. About halfway out. On the first little spot. And that's the top of the Palm Island group out here. And as you can see, normally you can see a row of islands there, so hopefully it doesn't look like that this afternoon when we're coming back to find some anchorage. But the sea's not too bad. Not ideal but not disgusting. Um, don't know if you'll be able to see bait GTs too well, so there might be a bit of blind casting going on. But, um, yeah. Back over land here looks terrible. Pinchy. Where we've come from, sugar loader, palm group. Big storm. Bit brewing out here, but where we're sort of heading doesn't look too bad. But yeah, I just hope this group of islands out here doesn't look like that this afternoon. But anyway, keep going.
you. There we go. Little Mac Jonah, 10 bait. <laughs> Just seen the um, seen the school of birds working. Pulled up, probably 10k short of the reef. Nice little Mackey. <laughs> you. A lot more fun on the fly rod. Wouldn't bother otherwise. All right, buddy. See you later, mate. Gone. Ah, <laughs> oh, it's good. That storm's moving out to sea. It's getting lumpy. I'm happy with that, boys. Here we are on the reef's edge. A little bit lumpy. End up flying around with them back tuna. Got a couple more. Sort of had it sussed. I was just steaming into the pack. Like full bore. And then just just casting into no man's land and pulling as hard as I can, retrieving and end up with a couple of tuna. what that is but it's got fucking spikes on its tail I don't know what that is it's got a lot more spikes oh now if you can see all them squid there heaps of them down there. I'll have to get the squid jag out in a bit. They were pretty small though. Alright, let's keep casting. One of them little buggers. All the nomad vibe. There he is. There they are.
nursery. Pretty fish, but uh, nothing worth writing home about. Coral cod, look like trout. Things. Another one of these. If anyone knows what they are, let us know. We always get them on these shallow flats. I haven't done this for a while. Just throw a little, little light set up vibes. in the dead time of the tide. I can't really match any time today. Oh, Jesus. Fucking straight on. Sweet. I just haven't done this for ages. Good fun. Spiky little buggers. Hey, you want to get a decent size one of them, I might keep them. Too bad to chew on it.
Tuskies everywhere, see? Hence why I picked up the floor. Yeah, oh, I get heaps of questions about this bimini. It's um, from Kingfisher Eclipse. So if you're interested, check out the link in the description below. And um, have a sauce. They're real good bimini's. If you are looking to buy one, follow my link. I get a little... Uh, little incentive offer I get 50 bucks for the sale so, uh, I'm not sponsored by this or anything. I literally just bought this at my own will and made a video on it and then they got in contact with me so if you're interested check it out that's her all set up it took me five minutes bit of a storm coming this is that storm that was around the palm group and it just slowly sort of headed out to sea and it's kind of surrounding me which isn't great yeah been up on the reef for a while now i haven't seen any bust ups or gts or anything um i'm just in the wrong part like high tide was first thing this morning when i launched so low tides at oh, what do we got here low tides in about an hour's time so yeah, I suppose I'll stay on this reef and fish the low tide and prefer fishing the high tide, but that's not again till 4 o'clock to Sarvi, so sit tight, have a bit of a rest and uh, go from there. Anyway, but yeah, if you are interested in these and you are going to purchase one, because I'm pretty sure they've sold shitloads of them up here. Um, a lot of people have seen my thing, but because they're not clicking through my link <clears throat> I'm not getting any piece of the pie which is fine I'm happy to help the company out like they sort of reached out to me once I'd done that video and said oh hey we'll throw you 50 bucks um, a sale you know so it's all fuel for the boat <laughs> oh god but yeah if you're interested check out the link and, um, and if you are going to buy one go through my link Bobbing about at the moment. About to get pissed on, I think. Have a cheese and crack from server. Oh, yeah. Time to win. About to get wet. I love it when I plan to camp out here. I'm not in a rush with the fishing. When you're on a day trip, you're just like, right out. Need to get here, GG, GG, trout, bloody, go, and then we'll go chicken, and then we'll go top. When I'm sleeping out here, I really don't care, I just float around, take the time. Oh. Don't like look at the storm I'm about to get.
Oh, Lucky boy. Oh man. I can't believe my camera went dead. Holy shit. Probably about a 7 8 kilo GT on fly, 12 weight. On the dart wing, I think they're called. Yoo oh, I cannot believe my camera went dead. Um, fucking real. Alright, let's get him back. Well, we've come in from the reef now. It's at the top of the Palm Island group. Um, yeah, it's gonna slip around here basically. And do, do a bit of trolling and see if there's anything. 10 past four, so have another top water session hopefully. And then make our way down through these islands and find a camp. Should be good. Oh, oh, Jesus! We are on, man! Big! 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 Wow! Oh! That was strange! Here he is. 
What is it? It's a fucking giant Spanish macro. Woo! Trolley troll paid off, eh? Man, he run. He had me in some hurry, man. Ooh. Hey, 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 hey. Let me sort this out. I'll bring him in the sunlight. Oh. There we go. Just trolling around this corner here. Spano, it's turned out to be a pretty good day so far. Slime City, all right, he's going in there. Be one somewhere. Oh, I got Spanish hit at first. And a banger. Oh. Oh. Fucking can't believe I missed that take. Fuck it. That was cool, as man. What's that? Yeah, the banger. Little banger. He's green as. They're aggressive little buggers, aren't you? Hey. Fish. 
Up to myself. There we go. Spanish mackerel. Yeah, oh, it's a good spot to uh, find me fish up and uh, gather me bearings, I think. Good little spot that one. I've camped on here before, you need a permit. Just thought I'd fill you in. I'm actually going to go back to the ramp. I've got a chronic friggin' headache. And I left me painkillers and me headache tablets in the car. So I'm going to go back to the ramp. Uh, I've got a really nice meal to cook up and that. Uh, so it looks like we're camping somewhere, but just not out here, unfortunately. Yeah, I've been, I've had it since the Savi and I've just been like trying to shake it, but it's really kicking in now and it's just not going to be a bloody enjoyable night. So shoot back the ramp, chuck the boat on and go set up camp somewhere. I know there's a free camp at Halifax there, so I might go there or I might go catch up with Lee, the boat hired plug. Either way, we'll be back out here in the morning anyway for another fish. Oh, such a shame. Fucking headache tablets. But yeah, I just, I won't, I won't last out here. I can just feel it. It's, you just know what it's like. The headache kicks in, you're done. Idiot. Alright, back the ramp.